Preparing for the GATE biotechnology exam requires a strategic focus on the key topics that are frequently covered. Here is a list of important topics to prioritize for the GATE Biotechnology 2025. First is Engineering Mathematics. From here, Linear Algebra, Matrix Algebra, Eigenvalues and Eigenvectors are very important. From Calculus, Functions, Limits, Continuity, Differentiation, Integration, Partial Derivatives must be studied. Differential Equations, First Order Equations, and linear differential equations are also important. Probability and statistics, mean, median, mode, standard deviation, random variables and probability distributions. And from numerical methods, the linear and nonlinear algebraic equations, different examples must be prepared well. Next unit from general biotechnology, we have various subjects under that. From biochemistry, the structure and function of biomolecules, Amino acids, proteins, carbohydrates, lipids, and vitamins are frequently asked. Entire enzymology, including the kinetics, inhibition, regulation, etc. And metabolism, concentrate on only the carbohydrate metabolism and little bit on the vitamin metabolism. From microbiology, focus on microbial growth, their classification, and the sterilization techniques. Cell biology, cell structure, cell cycle, and signaling pathways. For signaling pathways, you must know the signal name and the receptor molecules. You can expect match the following questions. Immunology, immune system components, antigen-antibody interactions, vaccines, under antibodies, study the monoclonal and polyclonal antibodies, also have an idea of the hybridoma technology. For immunoassays, different techniques such as ELISA, RIA and flow cytometry should be covered. Biotechnology and human health, the different causative agents, disease diagnostics and therapeutic agents must be studied. From genetics and molecular biology, DNA replication, transcription, translation, gene regulation is important. Under genetic engineering and recombinant DNA technology, focus on cloning vectors, gene cloning and also recently they are asking about CRISPR-Cas9. From genomics and proteomics, study the genome sequencing, functional genomics and also regarding the protein-protein interactions. Next is engineering principles which have been recently added to the gate BT syllabus. Under this focus on mass and heat transfer, the topics such as diffusion, convection, heat exchanges, focus on the numerical problems and the formulas also. Chemical engineering principles for that fluid mechanics and also the classic, classical thermodynamics, even bioenergetics should, should be focused on. We all know that for uh, gate BT, the marks weightage is mostly on engineering mathematics and bioprocess engineering. But also there is a good amount of weightage for general biotechnology and plant and animal biotechnology as well. So from plant and animal biotechnology, specifically from plant, focus on genetic modification, the different plant tissue culture techniques and also the secondary metabolites. Whereas from animal biotechnology, focus on the components of the animal cell culture techniques and the process of transgenic plants and animals and also the process of animal cloning. Don't forget to study about the molecular markers as well. Now, when preparing for the GATE BT exam, focusing on bioprocess engineering and process biotechnology section is very crucial. This unit carries significant weightage in the exam and approximately 20 marks are guaranteed from this topic. Generally, students tend to miss out on this, but if you want to improve your rank, then this is what is your go-to unit. Let's delve into the important topics within this unit. From the first bioreactors and fermentation, study about the different type of reactors like stirred tank, air lift, packed bed and fluidized bed reactors. The bioreactor design and operation, study about the scale up principles and also the different aspects like aeration and agitation and different sterilization techniques like methods of sterilization, bioreactors and media. Don't forget to see the thermal death kinetics as well. Next is kinetics and dynamics. Here microbial growth kinetics focus on the Monod equation, substrate limited growth and yield coefficients, 
enzyme kinetics the michaelis maintain kinetics which is also common with the biochemistry portion the inhibition kinetics different type of enzyme inhibition like competitive non competitive uncompetitive and how their growth and equations look like and also the immobilized enzyme systems the product formation kinetics study about the types of product formation such as growth associated and non growth associated from the transport phenomena study about mass transfer which is oxygen transfer in bioreactors and mass transfer coefficient oxygen uptake rate from heat transfer study the uh, different heat transfer processes in uh, bio process and design of the heat exchangers for fluid flow study the flow regimes specifically don't forget reynolds number and also the design designing of the piping and the pump from downstream processing cell disruption which are the mechanical and non mechanical methods separation techniques such as centrifugation filtration sedimentation etc and most important are the purification methods lots of questions are asked like chromatography affinity ion exchange gel filtration precipitation and extraction study their principles and also the application in questions they might also give you tabular forms of different levels of purification and they can combine with an enzymology question like how much percentage of purification is achieved in every step next you have to study about filtration understand the principles of filtration processes used in bio processing topics may include different types of filters then membrane filters and also the applications tuning of controllers study the control systems and their optimization in bio process learn about the types of control loops such as uh, the feedback feed forward proportional integral derivative that is pid controllers and also their applications and lastly don't forget the thiel modulus explore the concept especially in the context of catalytic re catalytic reactions and mass transfer understand how it relates to reaction rates and the reactor design by concentrating on these key areas you will be well prepared for the bio process engineering section of this gate pt exam Sometimes you also get questions from bioinformatics study about the sequence alignment molecular phylogeny from sequence analysis study about the blast and fascia multiple sequence alignment structural bioinformatics focus on protein structure prediction and molecular modeling and from databases gene bank pdb and gene browsers also you have to take a general idea environmental biotechnology few questions are seen on bioremediation that is the microbial degradation of pollutants and biosensors whereas from waste management we see questions on treatment of industrial waste and bioleaching so overall these sections can be covered with uh, reference books for uh, the reference books you can refer to biotechnica website articles where we have published the gate bt important topics also and the reference books along with that if you want you can enroll for uh, gate coaching that biotechnica conducts all the concepts that you need for uh, this important topics which are enlisted will be covered in the classes and along with that what is most important is uh, analyze the previous year question papers if possible study the type of questions that are asked and uh, sometimes in gate bt they will repeat the type of questions so sometimes you can also get a repeated question with just a few factors changed that's all from now thank you